Hey guys, this is Soul Rag333 with another custom review. And here I have the McFarlane Toys DC Multiverse New 52 Cyber Superman. And he looks awesome. Uh, funny thing, I tried, I started off using the panel lining, uh, what was it, Tamiya uh, paint, and I ran out. I just had a very very little amount and I used it on the jaw first which looks awesome and then I just like a little bit and I tried maybe adding water to it to maybe you know thin it out a little bit more and I don't know what that thing is made out of but there was some weird chemistry going on when I added water that little bit of Tamiya black panel lining liquid turn into a thick goo it, <laughs> so and, and the more water i added it, it i don't know what happened it just turned the whole thing into a just goo <laughs> so then i tried a, another uh black paint uh it didn't apply it the way I thought it would and it's like rather than an experiment I'm gonna use what I know and I did use uh, flat black testers acrylic paint I do have some left for the silver bits and then use testers acrylic uh, aluminum dry brushing so back to basics with the testers that I do have see perfect ah Rustoleum, they own testers acrylic paints. They need to just bring it back, put it, a new label on it if you need to. But they need to bring that paint back for customizers, you know, people that do modeling. Just bring it back, because <laughs> this was perfect. It's easy. It felt comfortable. It was easy to do. Uh, then I gave it a blue wash the same wash that I used on I already forgot what I used it on uh, oh the the ghost of Krypton Superman um, so here he is uh, now when I started applying the paint I removed the cape with the hot water and for the most part it came off easy the left side is easy that there's a lot more glue on this side so that got kind of cut there and the left side popped off easy and the right side was a little bit more difficult so i'm going to glue this on after the video but yeah i think that looks awesome and the blue wash is perfect I, I didn't do anything else other than just apply the blue wash dirtied up the, the blue the dark blues got in between the crevices and then it also darkened the top part, which I think looks cool. And uh, yeah, the cape just pegs on there. So I'm gonna glue this on afterwards. And this one is gonna fit on the left collar easy. This one, cause it got torn up, I'll probably trim that in there trim it and then glue that in there but and I forgot to mention it in the previous video I love this soft gummy plastic for the capes uh, if they're not going to do the cloth wired capes then this is the way to go and I think this is what they needed to use for long hair uh, on the female figures and everything else there he is thanks for watching